guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Shantae, and thank you for tuning in with Shake It Up with Shantae. If you've been here before, welcome back as always. And if, if this is your first time tuning in, welcome, welcome, welcome. Thank you guys so much. Well, today I'm doing something a little different. I've never taken you guys on a grocery store run with me or any other runs with me. So today, since I'm headed out to the grocery store, I decided to take you guys along with me. So I'm headed to a couple of grocery stores. Um, of course, I'm not dry. I'm not driving, but um, my husband is, and I'm just going to the grocery store, and I decided I want to take y'all with me. So just stay tuned, and we're pulling up at Publix right about now. All right, y'all. We done pulled up at Publix, and we're about to go in here. I'm just recording up to this point, but I am going to get my husband to record once we get inside because our, uh, I can't record and shop at the same time, y'all. That's just something I just can't do. I can't record and shop at the same time, so I ain't even gonna try. But anyway, about to walk into Publix. Here's the Publix.
All right, y'all. So we up out of um Publix, and now we're headed to um Food Depot. When I tell y'all Publix was so crowded, Publix was super crowded. It was like, whoo, don't ever go to the grocery store at around about 7 o'clock in the evening, baby, because it's crowded. Y'all can see it's getting dark outside here. The sun has gone down a little bit. This is the time I had to go to the grocery store, y'all, because I was busy early today. So, you know, I got to do what I got to do. So, here I am pulling up at Food Depot. Food Depot. I'm at the Food Depot.
All right, y'all, I'm back at home, back at home from the grocery store. I went to a couple of different grocery stores. As you all can see, I went to Publix, then I went to uh, the local food depot. I still didn't get everything I needed from the grocery store because what I like to do is when I go grocery shopping, I don't have any little kids at home. So what I like to do is I normally typically go to the grocery store as needed, like I like to go to the grocery store every other day. If I'm going to cook something fresh, I like to cook it fresh. I don't really like to take meat out of the freezer, thaw it out. I do sometimes, but I don't really like that. I, if I'm, It depends on what I want to cook that day, and then I'll just go to the grocery store and get what I need on a daily. I don't really like to buy a bunch of groceries. But this time, we were low on certain things, so I said, let me go to the grocery store. And then I wanted to do a grocery haul on this channel because I've never done one. So I just wanted to show y'all some things that I buy from the grocery store, what some of my favorite things are and where I get them from. So with all that being said, let's jump right into this haul really quickly because I need to cook, honey. I'm going to cook me some catfish nuggets, some coleslaw, and some shrimp. That's what I'm going to cook me in a minute. So, And I ain't recording it either, but I'm just going to show y'all what I got. All right, so the first bit of stuff, let's do from Publix first. So, the stuff I got from Publix. All right, so I got this bag of broccoli, fresh. I like to buy this from Publix. I like to saute that by itself with butter and garlic. I got some blueberry um, bagels. I got some onion bagels. And I like to eat that with um, this smoked salmon cream cheese. If you've never had this, let me tell y'all something. Get you some bacon, a couple of slices of bacon, an uh, egg, fry your egg, and put you some of this smoked salmon cream cheese on there. Woo, woo, honey. You won't be disappointed. That'll be the best breakfast you ever had. Oh, what else I got? I got yogurt. I'm trying to eat yogurt. I really don't like yogurt as much, but I would eat it if I got some of these um, granola. And I got the pecan maple flavored granola chips. Um, they just little oats, granola oats. So I'll eat it. If I can put some of this in there and give it a little crunch, I'll eat that. So I got like, they were 10 for 10 at Publix. So I got my little 10 for 10. I got some peach, some regular. I got some um, honey and what flavor is this? Blueberry. I got that. And I also grabbed this. I don't know if y'all ever tried this fruit and chai, fruit and chai seeds, but this is peaches, strawberry, and dragon fruit. So this is how it looks. And I like to eat. I like to put them in the refrigerator so they get cold and I like to eat that. So I got these right here. This um pork sirloin cutlets. I got that. I may cook that tomorrow because like I said, I don't like to really freeze meats. And then my freezer are already full. I have two freezers and both of them are already full. So I ain't really get too much of meat. But anyway, these were buy one, get one free. I love to drink hot tea and hot coffee. Um, and I also love, 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 uh, cold coffee. I like iced coffee. So I use this when I'm making my iced coffee. And how I do that is I really have a video of that on my channel, how I make my cold coffee. But pretty much what I do is I just make some cold coffee. Well, I make it hot and I put the sugar and I don't put any cream. I just make Instant hot coffee, which um, Nescafe is my favorite brand of coffee. I use the regular, and I just uh, make me some hot coffee, put sugar in it, and put it in the refrigerator. And when I go for being glass, I pour some of this in the bottom of the glass, and then I pour my coffee on top. Best, best iced coffee you can get from anywhere. And I got all uh, Italian sweet cream and hazelnut. All right, I got bananas. I got some cherry plums. If you haven't tried cherry plums yet, Get you some cherry plums. Go to Kroger and get you some cherry plums. To me, they're sweeter and they're more crunchier than regular plums. And you could just take a couple of these versus a big old plum and eating it. I'd rather have these. These taste really, really good. I got a bag of blood and oranges. Um, if you've never had a blood orange before, they're very, very good. And my grandson, he loves them. So he's over here, you know, so I got oranges. I don't really get a lot of snacks because we don't have no little kids in the house. It's just me, my husband, and my grown daughter. So we don't buy a lot of snack foods and stuff like that. I mean, we do get ice cream because I got to have me some butter pecan ice cream, which I bought, but it's already in my freezer because I like it to get hard. So I got me some butter pecan ice cream in there. 
I have me some um peach mango green tea crystal light singles to go on my bottle of water. I have this right here, this hazelnut ha um cafe. This is really not like coffee. This is more like a it's already sweet, so you only have to add the hot water. And they sell it in many different flavors, mocha, uh, vanilla, French vanilla. They sell it in many different flavors. So if you haven't tried this and you like to drink you some um, hot, creamy coffee, um, this is already creamy as well. But, you know, I'm still going to put me some extra cream in now just because. But I like hazelnut. As you can see, I'm, I love hazelnut. I got the cream and the coffee. I love hazelnut. I also got these from Publix. They were buy one, get one free, which they was really normal price because if you go on any other grocery store, these are 99 cents. So it was $2, buy one, get one free. And I got strawberry and blueberry. My daughter likes to make those. I got bread. If you have not tried this bread before, best bread in the whole wide world to me. The best bread. They got the one that's um by by this brand, but they got the brioche kind, brioche roll type, and that's kind of sweet, which I don't like it. So I like this, the original one right here. I love this. Also, I got the potato rolls. I'm gonna eat some of this with my fish and coals on hush puppies in a minute that I'm about to cook. I'm gonna eat some of it with them. If you haven't had potato bread, potato rolls now, potato bread is kind of um expensive, like. Like, a lot of times I get the hamburger buns or the hot dog buns because they do sell it in that. They don't sell potato rolls and regular loaf bread. I don't think so. I really never looked for it, but I've never seen it. But um, best bread ever. My husband, Nature's Own Honey Wheat Fan, he loves it. This is all he eats. He eats this every morning. He toasts him, put him two slices in the toaster. Plain, he like it blackly toasted with his coffee. That's what he eats. Um, these right here, if you've never tried these, and I know they're not the most um highly rated expensive brand but these smell good when you put them in your laundry these are absolutely i mean these these are the crystal things and what did you put a cap full in your laundry before you start your, uh before you put your clothes in there i mean have your clothes smelling fabulous for weeks when i say it's say 12 weeks i ain't lying these was um buy one get one free and i want to say they were four dollars so that was a great deal at club they would buy one get one free uh i mean if you like, I like Gain. I'm a Gain person, and I know Downey has a brand. Gain has a lot, but these right here, these pure, pure crystals, honey, don't sleep on them because they are the bomb.com. All right, and I also got these. I like the um, Cascade Platinum for the dishwasher, which I need to load up a load right now and wash some dishes. Girl, I'm going to do that in a minute. All right, so that's all the stuff that I got from Publix. Now, we're going to move over to the Food Depot. All right, so this is some of the stuff I got from Food Depot. Like I said, I put ice cream in the freezer already. But look, listen, if y'all got a Food Depot or either in the store and they sell this right here, buy Sea Best, the raw catfish nuggets. If you like catfish, I like catfish. I'm going to make some coleslaw with it. I love it, love it, love it. Very, very good. They're raw, so of course you have to throw them out, season them up or whatever. They come in the frozen food section. Then I also buy catfish nuggets too by this brand, Louisiana Select. But I didn't I didn't see those that comes in a box that's already about and fried fried. So I got these raw ones. I normally get those as well. But these are the shrimp, the large breaded shrimp. Um they, they already seasoned, very, very good. You just drop them in some hot grease, baby, and you're good to go. Popcorn. Look, I love movie theater popcorn, and these were something that I seen new, the three-pack, the little small ones, which I couldn't wait to try, so I got two of those just because. Then right here, I got some mustard, regular stuff, my regular diced tomatoes that I got, the petite dice, the green chilies, the lime and cilantro. You can use that pretty much for anything. Sliced cheese, regular Velveeta kind, eat with sandwiches. I have butter. I use this butter right here when I'm making grits. And I also like to buy my regular Lando Lake butters when I'm baking or making anything. I got some um, avocado and salsa dip. If you've never had this and you like avocado, please try it. I got some Tostitos to go along with that. I really like the ones with the lime, but I've been eating those lately so much. I said, let me just try some regular ones. I got a bag of red beans and rice for... You know, when I am just don't feel like making it from scratch, I do me some red beans and rice. I got some Rotelli pasta. I got the Nor um, tomato bouillon with chicken flavor. I love, 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 absolutely love these. You can put them in everything. Soup, stews, whatever, whatever. 
small bag of yellow rice for daughter because she likes to cook that. I also got this emperor butter. I like to use this as well. Sometimes when I'm sauteing stuff, I like to use this butter right here. That butter has a, a great taste, a great flavor. If you've never um, tried this butter before, try it. I also got um, some sausages. They have the big 30 pack, but like I said, it's only a couple of us in the house and hubba don't eat pork. So me and daughter, I just get the small 18 count. I absolutely love, love, love this when I don't bake a cake from scratch. I always get it with some whipped topping. It, any kind, all of the whipped topping taste the same. And I also like the strawberries that come in a small plastic container, but they were out, so I got these. I just, I'm just gonna soak these in sugar, and then um, I like to pour it over my cake and put me some whipped cream on it. That, that's, that'll be my late night snack for two nights. Um, what else I got? Smithfield thick cut bacon. Only bacon I eat. Thick cut bacon. Let me stop lying. This ain't the only bacon I eat. I eat all kind of bacon, but I like this one right here. This is the best bacon. And this bacon costs about, whoo, this bacon like $8 a pack, something like that. I got a pack of ground beef, which I'm going to split this and freeze it. It was $9 from um, Food Depot. I got some cucumbers because ever since we went on vacation to Florida and, um, we didn't have nobody here to water our, our garden, so the cucumber plant kind of died out a little bit, so they haven't been growing as fast, so I had to get some from the grocery store. What a bummer. Anyway, I got some brownies. Everybody knows about brownies. I got some eggs. I got tea. Love me some sweet tea. Captain Crunch for every blue moon. Um, I'll eat some cereal every blue moon, and if I do, it's either Frosted Flake, Captain Crunch. I like other cereal, but as I done got older, I'm starting to like Oh, I don't really, I'm not a cereal person like that, but I will every blue moon. I got some grand biscuits. I got boiled peanuts. Y'all know boiled peanuts. If you're a country girl, get your boiled peanuts. I got some little Debra whole cakes. <laughs> little Debra whole cakes. <laughs> All right. I got these um, Koneku, Koneku sausages. These, these are... Some really good sausages. You need to try them if you have not done so. I have another pack of bacon here. See, I told y'all that was the only kind that I lied. I like all kind of bacon. So this is a thick cut too, but I do like thick cut. Thick cut, I love thick cut. I have these um, Johnsonville um, Better Cheddar Smoked Sausage Links. I like these. You know, you can make these out of, uh, you can deep fry them, make you some corn dogs with them. You know, get your batter, put them in there. Of course, what black household ain't got no noodles in there? Um, I got juice, half and half. I have to keep in the house. Heavy cream is a must to keep to do everything with. I have onions, I have limes, I have lemons, cheese puffs for the grandson. I have cookies for the grandson. Cilantro, y'all know I love me some cilantro. I have a bag of red potatoes. I have some grape. Nestle water. This is like the best water ever, you guys. Best water ever. Then I have, oh y'all, y'all, look. I ain't never seen this before, not unless I ain't never looked. Somebody, did, I've been sleeping on this if I have, and I hope this is good when I try it. Look good, it's by Say Relief. I hope this is good. I really hope this is good because I love me a good butter pecan pie, and I don't make, I don't know how to make it. So, and I ain't trying to learn right now. I could just buy this, and if it's good, I'm going to buy some more. I'm sorry. Um, DiGiorno Supreme Pizza. And I have Crisco Oil, which is my favorite. I have some apple juice. And, of course, forks and plates that you got to have in your house. I have a few more items over here. I have some um, Better Than Bouillon Seasoned uh, Vegetable Base. When I saute my... Vegetables, I like to use that. I have sour cream, sugar, coleslaw, which I'm going to be making tonight. Donuts for the hubby. I don't like chocolate stuff really like that. Um, I got some um, creamy mushroom chicken pot pie. Daughter likes these. I got three of those. I got instant potatoes. Daughter likes and not me. And I have another thing of water. And also, I found this at um, Publix. This, did I get this at Publix or Food Depot? I think it was Food Depot. Um, ginger pineapple juice. It was $4 for this little thing. 
No gluten, no sodium, no fat, no cholesterol. It's A-shaped me. Okay, I shook it already. And it's a ginger pineapple. When I tell y'all, I just sipped it. I just sipped it like... Woo! You can taste that ginger. You can taste that ginger, baby. That ginger strong. And it has 14 grams of sugar in it. But... Woo! Uh, it tastes really, really good. I ain't even gonna lie to you. It's something I can drink. If I let it get cold, cold, this is something I can drink. It, it actually tastes good. Mmm. Woo! Well, that's it, y'all, for my grocery haul. That's all I got. Now I gotta put all this stuff up. Well, I'm gonna have some help. Trust me. I put all this stuff up. And then I'm about to cook my food and shut it down for the night because it's late, y'all. It's like... It's 10.30, y'all. It is 10.30. So, um, it's time for me to get out of here. If y'all, uh, if y'all even watch this video, if you watch the video, either thumbs it up, subscribe, or leave a comment saying that you're new to the channel, or you just liked it, or you subscribe. One of the two. I wish that you just didn't watch it. Just one of the three. Do one of the three. Either subscribe, like it, or leave a comment. I really appreciate you guys so, so much. And thank you for the, this journey with me today. It's been a long day for me. I'm super tired, but I'm going to eat anyway. And then I'm going to bed until the next video. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you then. Bye-bye.